Hi, I'm Eric Paul, the Chemistry Guru, and you are watching H2 Chem Hacks, making H2 Chemistry simpler, one video at a time. Hi, in this video, we'll go through how to draw the alpha helix. Now, we know that protein structures have basically four levels, the primary structure, the secondary structure, the tertiary structure, as well as the quaternary structure. Now, the alpha helix is actually our secondary structure, held together by hydrogen bonds at regular intervals between peptide linkages. Now, if you look at the diagram of my alpha helix, you notice this looks like a spiral or a telephone cord. This is, is in a very, very regular uh, arrangement, and the coils are all held together by hydrogen bonds between uh, peptide linkages. Of course, if you notice in diagram form, it's actually pretty complicated for us to draw. Now, in uh, questions, if you were if you are asked to draw the alpha helix, we'll draw a pretty simplified version of our alpha helix. So let's take a look at how uh, we do that. Uh, basically, it's very simple. What we do is we draw uh, two peptide bonds, one on top of the other. Now, you notice in this case, the peptide bond, we stay on drawing as a C double bond on the left-hand side and NH on the right-hand side. We draw in the reverse uh, way. Now that I have my two peptide bonds, I can draw a hydrogen bond between these two peptides. Now the next thing you need to do is just to draw the uh, polypeptide uh, chain which starts from, from the top right hand corner you come down, join to carbon, exit nitrogen you loop one round, join to carbon, exit nitrogen and then loop another round and it continues down And so this is how we draw our alpha helix if you have enjoyed this video, please share this with your friends. To learn more about H2 Chemistry, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram or Twitter. If you want to know more about my H2 Chemistry classes at Nishan, please visit my website. Thank you for watching H2 Chem Hacks. I hope I've made H2 Chemistry simple for you. I'll see you next time.